folks. Today we're gonna to be reviewing the Powerbeats Re Wireless. Super excited to check this out. Finally got these in, so I'm excited to see exactly what they have to offer. Uh, we went ahead and actually took a look inside the ear earbuds, so I can explain a little bit about that as well. But specifically with the Powerbeats Re Wireless, looks like you have a longer battery life. The way it charges, it charges a lot faster. A couple design changes on the actual headphones. They look exactly the same, but there's a couple little features I'm gonna explain just so you guys know exactly what you're getting. So let's go ahead and open these animals up and see exactly what they have to offer. Super excited to check this out. We've been really busy with our repairs and, and whatnot this week, so I haven't had a chance to do this a little earlier, so excited to bring this to you guys. All right, so the box looks exactly the same like the previous edition, which is the Powerbeats 2 wireless. Go ahead and open this up. The struggle is real. Lots of, uh, might want to use some pressure there. So this coming out like this. This is how it looks. Front, back side. This is definitely different. Got the whole case right here. You got your, your ear tip replacements, three different sizes. You also got a new case. That's interesting. Difference, nice uh, silicone type case. We got your charger cable right there as well. You got your user manual along with all the other information. Interesting, all right. Definitely interested in checking these out to see what these have to offer. All right, so in terms of design change, design change, there's a couple different things that change. The actual look of them look exactly the same. That's true. Uh, the wire size is exactly the same as well. The main difference is what's going on, on the inside of the actual earbuds. There's a different color plastic circuit board, which means it's a different board in general. It has a W1 chip, the Apple design. So this, these headphones have the same exact battery as the Powerbeats 2 wireless, except for it's way more efficient. So you have almost twice the amount of battery life, going from seven hours to 12 hours of battery life on this specific pair. So you get a lot more use out of this pair right here. I'm really excited to see if there's any difference in sound. Let's check this out. The ease of pairing these is one of the other features we're gonna be talking about. It's a lot easier to pair this. All you gotta do is press the power button. And you'll see that it's, you're gonna have a pop up on your phone right away and it's gonna connect a lot quicker. And since you have a W1 chip in here, you're gonna be able to have a clearer sound along with less interference when you're playing music. Let's see, get some music going here. Let's see if there's any difference. Interesting. Don't really see too much of an actual sound difference from one model to the other. One of the interesting parts about this model here is the actual control talk module. Um, that's something that they changed up completely because of the previous edition which had a lot of issues with this control talk module falling off. It looks like this actual design is different. It's completely different than the other one, which is really interesting. This is a, a two or two design, which is completely different than the Powerbeats 2, which is previous to this. That's an uh, interesting change that they introduced. So this whole control talk module was a completely different design. Uh, the last change that we really did see right here was that the um, actual micro USB charger right there. There's nothing holding, before there was a little flap that went in and out, now there's nothing there. It's just an opening, and I'm guessing that they, uh, went ahead and sealed the outside, that way that no sweat gets inside. I'm really interested to see the prolonged period of uh, use on these headphones. A lot of the Powerbeats wireless had a lot of uh, seep a lot of seeping of the sweat going inside the circuit boards along with the plastic circuit board inside here. And I'm guessing that they designed it better that way there's not gonna be issues in the future. All right, I'm gonna listen to some more music and kind of explain what I hear. But I believe we could cover almost everything there. Same design, you got over the ear right here, adjustment. You can wear this over the back, over the front. It seems like this microphone built in here is also a better version just because there's less stuff restricting the microphone 
So I'm excited to test that out. Since I'm always on the phone, I'll be testing that out. All right, let's jam. So the actual sound quality is no different than the other model. I don't see any difference there at all. And the actual loudness is no different either. The only difference is the efficiency of the battery, the efficiency of the board, and the fact that you have a better connection from your phone to your PowerBeats 3 wireless. All right, folks, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let us know if there's any videos you guys would like to see. Follow us on all our social platforms, Instagram, Snapchat, at JoeGE. And you guys can follow us on Facebook, at Joe's Gaming and Electronics. All right, folks, comment below, share, subscribe. We definitely enjoy you guys' time. Take care.